So, I'm joined here by the newest member of Video Game Boot Camp himself, Dr. Peep, who's just coming off a loss to Clash Harness's very own Mewtwo King. The rivalry continues. Streams, teams, everything. Streams. So, so how do you feel? How do you feel at this event right now? Uh, I feel very warm. I'm wearing two shirts. Sounds like a personal problem. <laughs> Well, I've also started running a lot lately, so my metabolism's higher, body okay. temperature's higher. Yeah, it's. I guess it is uh, a bit uh, of a personal problem. Yeah. Same here. I've, I've been jogging a bit. Yeah. You Shake know. your hand. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. Know. He's getting fit, dude. Yeah. That's what I'm know, talking about. Summer smash. You know, we're gonna have. We're gonna be in Vegas on the street. We gotta look good. We gotta, we gotta represent. Good, you know, smash. Well, I mean, you. The calendar. Uh, uh, I don't want to. I don't want to talk about you know what's underneath here. Oh. <laughs> the chisel abs that were carved from marble, the same one that was used to build the Pantheon. No. That's probably like kind of crumbling at this point, isn't it? Oh no, not these. I no, keep no these. you keep, I keep you, you exchange it for new marble every <laughs> once in a while. <laughs> you have to go to a new quarry. Right. But right, um, yeah. how was everything last night? Because I'm hearing conflicted reports. I heard that you were at D1's apartment, and I heard that you were playing steps with Mango. And Mango came in here and said, Oh know, boy. He said like that it was maybe 30 to 2 against your Marth <laughs> with him winning. And D1 <laughs> said, You know, it was maybe 70 30 in your favor. Now, D1's kind of the neutral guy on this, but since you get to be as biased as Mango was in describing it, how did it go in your favor? Do you want the do you want the biased report or do you want the whatever how I actually feel about it report? Because I can bias this up pretty well, make it fun. Give me both. All right. Well, if you want the if you want the biased report, how free was he? Was he freer than unknown? It was pretty bad. Uh, but there were especially especially early on when you hear about when you hear about warm up Johns. It was he was, he was getting it he was getting it pretty hard a little bit like we started with my fox's Marth mm -hmm. and he got me a little bit he got me a couple games and then like I started whooping him so he quit doing that he got upset about he got he, there was no more Marth there's, from him that night I, I, kicked, I kicked him off I kicked him off Marth he didn't know that character so you were rotating on him yeah we were rotating on each other a little bit Ooh. it was it was a pretty it's getting to be a pretty interesting time for both of us we're getting better with like a lot of the better characters mm. so what was happening was uh. We we eventually like the what what Mango will talk about the whole time that he'll ignore like the part where he got whooped a whole bunch in the beginning and Oof. like and he wouldn't get off the TV and he kept like telling Scar to like wait to play friendlies because he wanted to keep playing. Shots fired. He waits until he wins like two sets and then he gets up and he starts like showering and eating. Yeah, he's like and I, I, he's I, like I, he's like oh yeah you know, let him get cold let him get tired then he comes back and wants to play me some more then he wants to brag about it because I'm like exhausted and he's like he's been sleeping all day and he's starting starting to wake up. I'm like all right yeah that's cool man that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> that's straight and he but the mat I mean I'm not even in my most biased account I'm not gonna sit here and say that the sets were my favorite but I also but like <laughs> if Mega if Mega's gonna drink before every tournament and then he's gonna say oh you know I wasn't playing well or he's gonna think he's better than everyone and then wonder like what happens when people are good and they beat him and he's like oh how did this happen I'm like the best thing happened in this game well there sometimes there there are Johns for other people and I was exhausted so there you go. There's my, there's the biased version. Super biased. I learned a whole lot in those matches. To be fair, I was using them more to like learn than actually just like whoop him. Uh -huh. And he was, and he used them to just like trash talk me because, <laughs> I mean, he he knows the matchups pretty well because he gets to play with like good people all the time. And I was like, I never get to play like people that are like really skilled with like spacies. So I was like, I'm not. I'm just trying to, trying try to figure, figure this out. out. Okay. Yeah. But all that aside, like, yes, he did. He won the majority of the friendlies and he wouldn't go fox against me again i will say that i think i had that figured out by the time he came back but he took like a 30 minute break and what i was just trying to make me mad or he stopped being salty whichever one but i think i had his fox but he won't he won't play with me again he wants to just do falco and he kept trying to call out my my falco but the thing was he had a hard time kind of like feeling all right about it because oh. every single Wait, what is it? Well, I mean, it's it's good to yeah, hear no. that from you, but actually we're going to see Mango in action right now. Oh, we're going to watch him? Team with Scar up against Reno and Cactuar. He's going to so do work. He's going to do work. Are you going to join me here during the sudden commentary? Okay, I'll commentate. I'll be, I'll be nice. I'll be nice. Wow. Dr. Peepee will not leave me alone. 